Hey everybody, DJ Jekyll here. Welcome to my channel. If it's your first time and you like what you're seeing and you want to be the first to get new information and new videos when they come live for you, make sure you hit that little subscribe button, hit the bell so you get notified. And um, again, thank you guys so much. Let's get to that show. Well, I guess I should have the mic on, huh? Right on. Well, welcome everybody. Got some easy tips going here. Um, I'm a little surprised that there are some coiners out there, export, export coiners, is that what you want to call it, that are having some issues with the game that they've never, uh, I guess, encountered. I don't know. But I, I've seen this happen where, you know, you send your ship out to do some chores and it comes back all dead and you're like, what the fuck, right? Well, uh, I, I, don't know, I, I don't know how to say this, but uh, the coiners, this is why getting advice from heavy coiners and so-called experts is a bad idea because they're always trying to push you to grind and grind and grind and work. No, this is a game, this is for entertainment, this is for fun. So you should have fun. There should be no work involved. If you have to work at it, it's not a game, it's not fun, it's not entertainment. That defeats the whole concept of what gaming is. Okay? So let's get that out of the way. The simple thing is when you hit a target, uh, you have to check the settings on your mouse left or right. Um, for me, if I hit the right click, it pops up and it will tell me the... Uh, the target that I'm hitting give me a little bit of information. So, for your convenience, I have a little video of that. So let's uh, watch that. So I have my eradicators out. That's the research garrison. Obviously, it's not something I want to hit. So I look down and I can see, hmm, that doesn't say base parts. That's what I'm looking for is base parts. I want to get some easy base parts. You know, um, let's see what else I'm going to click on. There's a draconian, you know, let's say I want to get, you know, titanium. I'm going to click that. Oh, look, it says titanium. Okay, now I know I need to have my Saturns or Nemes. Oh, I have my eradicators. Oh, I clicked on the wrong one. Because sometimes I have eradicators out, infernal dragons, Praetorians, and, you know, um, Saturns and everything else. Oh, here's another one. See, this is for co-op. Oh, I should use the riot fleet. I see how it says riot. Okay, well, I don't want to hit that target. So it doesn't matter if it's stacked or whatever. But this person, expert, expert coiner, had a problem with base parts and because he clicked on the wrong target. Well, the subsector resource base is very important for uranium and base parts. It's something that you really need to get. And I don't have time to grind. So all I got to do is hit this a couple times for the base parts. Once, maybe twice for uranium, I can auto. It's a larger target. And the reason why they made it larger was so that you could see it and click it and find it real easy. So that's what you're going to do. You're going to click on it. You see how it's got the garrison thing on it. I don't you know, show that. Um, here, I can go back to that and show that again. Uh, oops, too far. I went too far. Can you believe that? There we go. See how it says, you know, for siege, and it's got a little base part. It's got a little garrison, which is a rook from chess. Uh-oh, there's chess in this. See? You, they're inside joke. And then to the right, you can see it's for skirmish fleets, uranium, things like that. So again, you don't have to grind, you don't have to do it. And I got a video on how to go to Orange, and there's also, you know, you just ask somebody in the sector to go into Orange, that'll help you out. Also, um, there's another video coming out tomorrow. 
for on how to get uranium a real easy super way if you don't want to hit the draconian base or maybe if you're just tired of it me you know i want to have fun i want to play i don't want to do work i don't want to do chores so with the riot and this is with the kick side riot there will be a build on it at the end of the video on how to get your ugh, how to get uranium super easy and how to click the right target because you're gonna <laughs> you'll see in the video there's no way to click the wrong target when you do it so that'll be out um you know what give me i think it comes out at 5 a.m let me see. Oops, that's not it. Hmm. Oh, no, my bad. 9.30. 9.30, super easy way to get uranium. So, look for that video out. Uh, let's see what else we got. So, it goes on its way, and then... You can see the line. You see that's going in. See again. I, I just I gotta I can't stress that enough. See how big the target is. So I know it's going the right. I got a few seconds to check on it. I'm gonna make sure. I know people got busy and they got things to do, which is why I also recommend recommend using the app. If you use the app, you click the target you want. There is no way you're gonna click the wrong one unless you do that yourself. And then you gotta take responsibility for yourself. But if that's not what you're trying to do, uh, let me go back to this. If that's not what you're trying to do and you want to hit the right target, use the app. Which is, yeah, I got a video on that as well. So that also help you prevent from uh, hitting the, the wrong target. So those are my easy tips for you because you don't want to send your ships out because you know how the game is on repair. Um, I do have some other videos too on how I, I believe uh, Battle Pie should be, because there are games out there where there's no repair virtually re seconds. I mean, hardly, you know, and that makes the game more fun. People can jump in. They can, you can talk about this, that, and the other thing. You can have fun. You can play. You can laugh. People actually laugh in other games. Anyways, I'm rambling. You guys have been fantastic. Uh, if you got any good information out of this, you know, like and subscribe. Hit the like button. Share it because you don't want your ships to get burnt and sunk, you know, without probably without you know a good reason. So hopefully this helps you out, help clears that out, and I'll see you guys on the flip side.